Hey, it's George. Today's Tuesday's tips and tricks will be how to use DaVinci Resolve to slow down that video that you took at normal speed instead of taking it at high speed and make it not so choppy as you can see by the two different timelines behind me. Let's get to it. What I've done here is to bring in some drone footage of Jim Bishop's castle in Rye, Colorado. In this clip, the drone is doing a point of interest shot and picks up speed as it completes the orbit. I told DaVinci Resolve to retime this portion to playback at 50%. Notice how choppy it is. In this segment, I applied the magic recipe to make it smooth again. Now we're at 10% normal speed, and it looks really bad. Again, some secret sauce. Now back to 100% to finish the clip. What's in the secret sauce? In the inspector, scroll down to retime and scaling. Change your retime process to optical flow and the motion estimation to speed warp. I seriously do not know why Blackmagic Design calls it speed warp, as it is so computationally intense, it will drop your workstation out of warp down to impulse speed for a few minutes. Also, rendering speeds go up dramatically. It is best to do this effect at the very end of your post production. Thanks for watching. To see more Tuesday tips and tricks, click subscribe and hit the bell.